Welcome to Bexley Public Library. Over the past century, thousands of patrons have walked through our door, making us a sanctuary for curious minds navigating the world of literature, technology, and human connection. As we mark this extraordinary milestone, we invite you to help us celebrate 100 years of being the heartbeat of a community that embraces curiosity, compassion, and knowledge. For more, here's your Bexley Library Director, Ben Heckman. Welcome to my office. Since 2017, it's been my honor to hold the position of Library Director for this amazing library serving this incredible community of ours. Something doesn't quite seem right. Zach, do you think you could help us out? Much better. I'm only the sixth person to hold this position in the 100 years of service to this community. So it's my pleasure, my honor, and my duty to invite you all to Bexley Public Library's centennial celebration. We have an incredible lineup of musicians, we have an impressive lineup of authors coming to visit us, and we have activities planned all year with lots of cake. So keep an eye out in your mailbox for a centennial invitation to come and celebrate the library's 100th birthday that'll have all the information and details that you need to come and celebrate with us. Now, before you leave, I want to introduce you to Mary T. Zimmerman. She served this community as library director from 1954 to 1971. And we want to share with you a poem that she wrote that we think embodies everything that's great about libraries. To kick off the celebration, the staff worked hard on this video, and I know you're going to love it. So sit back and enjoy, and happy birthday, Bexley Public Library. Teach me to read. And let me be reading about a million things. Fireflies, pyramids, Saturn's rings, lands that I may never see. Teach me to read and I shall know rocks that speak at Geiger Pass. Numbers, letters, energy, mass. Tides, moon moved from high to low. Teach me to read. Let me learn of yesterday's child, tomorrow's man. Moonlight spread where shadow ran. My house at the street's next turn. Books, please. I will quickly feed my hours that pass each single day with songs to sing, words to say, and friends for every present need.